Great day. Thank you for tapping into Gracefully Speaking. This is a Divine Feminine reading. While you are here, go ahead and hit the like and the subscribe button for me. I would greatly appreciate it. So, y'all. 555 five, five on, on the clock right now. Support. Mm. All right. Remote. Remote support something about remote support some of you guys could be trying to get a work from home position but let's get into what i'm already seeing so i'm seeing something that was given to you given to you by the divine there go a bluebird wow okay there was something which is double confirmation there was something given to you by the divine but what I'm seeing with this five of swords here, there could be some things going on that you don't see and that you can't quite put your finger on. Is that a red bird? It's a red bird and a blue bird. It's some things that are taking place or have taken place behind your back. Um, and I feel like this is with the individual because I have courtship on the bottom of one of the decks. Um, and this could also be some things that you felt in your spirit, your discernment. But there's a person that's getting ready to be cut out. Even though they were given to you by the divine. Even though you were connected and that was orchestrated. It's being cut off. I'm hearing the word severed. So ties are getting ready to be cut. And then I have a message here with a wealthy man. It's almost like spirit is swapping some things out. And swapping some people out. In this case, um, seven of cups. It's almost like. The person you could have been dating or taken seriously, it could have all been not an illusion, but it's like either this person has options and they're trying to weigh those options and it's clear that you're the best option, but it's like you still haven't chose me. And I was picking up earlier today, um, if you got to choose between me and somebody else, don't choose me. If you got to choose between me and someone else, do not choose me. Because what is, baby, what, did, what else you need to see? <laughs> what, else you, what else you need to see? Because this person knows as well as you know that and this could be some a past person for some of you guys or this could have been a person where you had a past life relationship with like a twin flame so you guys were orchestrated to connect back with one another but I'm, I'm feeling like somewhere along the lines someone is weighing trying to weigh their options trying to figure out and it's like why they trying to figure it out they about to lose their position they're about to lose their position. Maybe it's the draft. You know what I'm saying? This is is when it's time for the draft. This is not the time for you to slack. This is time we need, you need to pick your feet up. Pick your feet up. Holy Spirit, clarify message for the divine feminine. Clarify this message that's coming in for the divine feminine. Because I feel like, Divine Feminine, you've been, yeah, three. I stopped on the Three of Pentacles. There's been people that have been wanting to communicate with you, possibly take you out on dates. Um, you could be getting business cards from people just randomly as you walk into in the gas station. Um, like, here, take my car. Hey, can you get my number? And it's like, you're the type of person where if you are involved with someone, you only involve with that person. And... Divine Feminine, you also understand that what you put out is what you get back and you're being respectful of that. Okay? It's law, it's just it's it's just law. It's the code. It's the code. 
So when you know the code, you got to know how to play it. So you are at a space in a place where it's like, okay, if this is not working out, then I'll need to sever ties. I'd rather go ahead and sever ties than a lot of you. I'd rather sever ties than to hurt you, lead you on. Because if this person is still up in their head about other options or maybe they feel like they can do better than you, Divine Feminine, I don't know. Um, but it's like, what's better than number one? What's better than number one? All right, wait. Uh, clarify message. Somebody tell me what's better than number one in the comments. I'm, I'm trying to see some. Clarify message. Listen, Ace of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles. I feel like this blessing here, this Ace of Pentacles blessing, because it's you're receiving some type of message. But what I'm getting off this Ace of Pentacles, it's like you, you're going to get something even better. So it's like if you were dating someone seeing someone and you like man like they get me i can be myself i can do this i can do that and it's like man i probably won't find you feel like you may not find that elsewhere spirit is saying at, at, you will because i feel like in a lot of ways with this ten of wands at the bottom of the deck it's almost a burden for this person to place you in a position where you feel like you're being juggled or to feel like they got other options and they just like, well, let me see how this go first. No. Mm -mm. See how it go. What you think this is? Like, it, it, it's not making no sense. It's not really making sense. Because how do you know who I am to you and still play? How you know that I'm a blessing and I'm having sin, but you still playing? And I say you playing because... You, you trying to weigh out things you in some type of illusion it's like this person's all up in their head and divine feminine is, is in a place and space where I don't have time to teach you we're already teachers spiritual teachers you know what I'm saying you already have other people around you that you spiritually guide and teach not to say that your husband your spouse you won't you know, there's, there'll be things that you'll teach and you'll learn from each other. But I'm talking about the simple, basic things that you should just know. It's like, come on, you should know that you can't juggle me. You should know that you just can't have us up in the air where I feel like, okay, are we together? Are we not together? Like, what are we doing? Where are we at? Like, uh, having conversations after conversation because you're trying to get clarity. Give me one more on this message. Listen, nine of wands. Something's coming to a, a, an end. Because it's one thing after another. It's getting old. It's getting so old. And I feel like with this Knight of Pentacles, this is this wealthy man that's coming in. Now, wealthy doesn't mean common sense. Wealthy man does not mean they connected to the Most High God. So let's dig. Let's dig because what I'm, I'm what I'm getting off of this is that it's coming to an end with a person that was sent that was sent to you by the divine because of some things that are going on in the background that you don't have all of the details to it's like spirit is going to clear that pathway if this person does not come to a decision because i'm already seeing they already got some it's something it's someone on standby it's someone already on standby Tell me more about this wealthy man. Clarify wealthy man. And I keep seeing this Knight of Pentacles. Like this person gonna come in and sweep you off your feet. And it's not gonna be nothing that this other person gonna be able to do or say. Because you had an opportunity. See, now they, listen, Six of Swords. 
a lot of you guys going to be moving forward past this because you don't have no patience for it. You didn't did too much work. Baby, this person may come in and literally sweep you off your feet and this past person going to be sick. Yeah, five of wands. This, this past person going to want to fight. <laughs> this past person going to want to fight about it. They, they, I don't know. Mm. And if they don't want to tussle, it's going to be the communication. Still want to communicate for me. Still want to see me for me. You still want to go out on dates for me. No, all this got to stop, boo-boo. All this got to stop. See, now they gonna get, they'll get a chance to see how you've been treating all these other niggas. Because you've been with them. Because you've been with him. You know what I'm saying? Now this person going to get to see what it feel like to be on the other side of the coin. It ain't going to, it don't feel good. <laughs> it don't feel good. Clarify wealthy man. Clarify wealthy man. Then I'm going to get ready to close the read. Clarify wealthy man. Yeah, something is being swapped out. Something's being swapped out. Listen, wealthy man is clarified with the ace of cups. This person going to come in and sweep you off your feet. Period. This person finna come in and sweep you off your feet. Give me one more on this wealthy man. Sweep you off your feet. Just dead on that. 606. <laughs> June, June 6 could be significant to somebody. Is today June 6? I don't even know what today's date is. Today's date. Baby. Look. I just saw something on my watch said loading. Listen, this person coming in. Because see, this is the thing. People think it's a game right now in this season. Not only are people being elevated, but if if the people around them are not ready to elevate, they got to go. It ain't no four, four, five, six months, a year, two years. No. <laughs> If it ain't working, it's not working. If you don't know what you want, that's okay. That's okay. That's cool. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna move around. And if I get too far ahead, or if somebody else, oh, waiting in the wing. I was hearing waiting in the wing. It's like they got this wealthy man waiting in the wing, just in case this other person don't decide correctly and quickly but it's almost like with this person being all up in their head it's making you second guess them because it's like how you don't see this what else you don't see baby i'm gonna close the read what else you don't see spirit has somebody else waiting in the wing right now they're like no you're not gonna go without and you're not gonna be put on the back burner period Period. Give me one. Listen. And then I just saw speak up. This person better speak up. Quick. Because Divine Feminine finna be up out of there. Okay? We got feeling safe. Give me one for the Divine Feminine to close out the read. Holy Spirit. Yeah. Angels got somebody waiting up in the wing. <laughs> Do you hear me? <laughs> I ain't finna take all of these. This is fearless love. An awakening. Give me one. Give me just one to close out, please. They got a wealthy man waiting in the wing. Listen, manifestation and harvest is here. You've manifested this, baby. Okay, play if you want to. Number seven. Could be seeing seven, seven, seven. Let's see, 43. Oh, and then this is the high priestess. See, the high priestess is all knowing. A lot of y'all divine feminines are high priestess. And that's what these, these masculines have to come in understanding that even if we don't say anything, we know. We know. So it's like you might as well be straightforward with us. Because we already know it's it's a knowing. That's that high priestess. The high priestess holds all the secrets to the, to the universe. All right? The element, water. All right? So this particular goddess, let me show y'all so y'all can see. 
she's a fertility goddess and nimba is her living spiritual healing mass together they embody the sacred feminine and abundance her guidance give thanks you are being blessed it is harvest time pray attention <laughs> a season of great harvest is a season of great epiphanies you are prospering embodiment harvest is when you reap the blessings that you have sown the harvest is not just the fulfillment of your dreams but the creation of them your thoughts your imagination the blessing of you being here another day on this earth this is all harvest what seeds of generosity love support and goodwill can you sow in your community to create a bountiful harvest for all the declaration is we are always prospering put in the comments we are always prospering and that's why i said a lot of things are getting ready to change a lot of people are elevating a lot of people are in their harvest season and for the people that are around us if they cannot elevate themselves to the altitude which we are at this moment they will have to be left behind and they will be replaced with better and right now what i'm seeing for you divine feminine is some people in your life are being switched out and swapped out for better. Peace.